It's part one in Wanda's two-stage plan to try and kill me. Here, or Scott reviews things. Hello again, and welcome back to Scott Reviews Things. It's Sunday, March the 3rd, the 3rd today, is it March the 3rd? March the 3rd, also known as Scott's death date. So, rest in peace, Scott. Don't know why I'm speaking in a third person. That's a bit twatish, isn't it? Anyway, so Wanda is insistent on picking hot stuff up that might do me a physical injury. You might have noticed I've done <coughs> the one chip challenge, various curries and hot buddy things, hot sauces. She's seen these in Morrison's. Oh, well, they'll make a good video. Thanks, mate. And then after this, I am going to die because I'm going to be recording these. So this one's going to come out first. And then these proper pork chicken itchins, extreme naga chili. Now, my friend Barry Hodges, Barry under the stairs, Barry the bastard, has assured me they're fucking lethal. So I'm really looking forward to them. Leah is looking out the window. Wondering if I'm going to die or not. And I'm absolutely terrified, if I'm honest. My friend Dean has just released Baron Brewing Side Eye West Coast Pale. I'm sure that's going to be fabulous. So, Pringles have released four new flavours into the UK supermarket. I've picked up two. The two that interested me. Um, what are they called? Pringles Hot. The other two flavours are hot. Let's have a look. We have what have I got? Smoking barbecue ribs. Two chilies out of three. Uh, I'll get that one that one. And we've got kicking sour cream, which is only one for pussies. <laughs> so I've gone for the two that interested me. Um and probably one of them is gonna kill me. If these don't kill me, those fucking things will. So the first one that I've gone for, not cheap. Pringles anymore, and certainly not the really spicy ones. They seem to be warp up in price. These were one eighty-five for how many grams are they? Thirty grams. I bet there ain't. I bet there's about five grams. Uh, or is that? No, it's not. That's not. That's a lie. One hundred sixty grams. And these are saying these are the Mexican chili and lime flavor. Two on the Scorchio units. And then these bastards. Hot. Flaming cheese. Which are three on the lava falling out of your ass rate at three o'clock in the morning. Um, flavour lover, Pringle. And it is true, once you pop, you can't stop. As I'm sure I'm going to find out at three o'clock tomorrow morning where my arsehole pops and these start dropping out like lava balls. So, number one, we're going to go for the chilli and lime. I thought, they sound, I thought they sounded quite nice, to be fair. Um, complete not open them. But, ready to go. So, stage one of the stage three, when she's trying to kill me. Here we go. The crisps in the box. Lovely bit of smoke. Joking, obviously. It's like a, is, that a pap, is that a paprika in them? I can't read any of that. I haven't brought my glasses out. I'm a dickhead. Let me go get my glasses. I should be back. Anyway. I can read. I can read, you know. I mean, you think, can't you read? Of course I can read. Uh, what have we got in here? Have we got anything? 
that's going to be resembling any ingredients. I can't read anything on there. The dogs are off. Even they're shitting themselves. Chili and lime flavour. Dehydrate, sunflower oil, wheat flour, rice flour, seasoning. Paprika, garlic, onion, cumin. Paprika, paprika, black pepper and cayenne pepper. So it doesn't appear to be anything really spicy in there. So hopefully the first part of this trio of doom isn't going to kill one. Anyway, that's what they like. Oh, so nice to me. Can't, can't beat the look of a Pringle. Actually missed my mouth. Some of you are saying, that's almost impossible, you fat bastard, isn't it? There is a heat to them, but it's not massive. Well, picking up much lime. But there's a warming heat to them. More sort of, um, sort of, uh, paprika, come in. Come in. There's a warm sensation. They're not, and it's sat in the back of the throat. They're not unpleasantly hot. Um, two out of three stars. I think that's fair. They're all right. They're quite nice. I think. Uh, obviously, that like a, any bloody um, pep, uh, pep, uh, Pringles. You're going in for more, aren't you? Cayenne pepper, um, so, uh, paprika. There is some some heat in them. Um, some chili heat. Not unbearable. Actually, quite nice. Flaming cheese flavour. My mouth is on fire. As I saw my arse, I will be later. Here we go. Flaming cheese, what's in these? Flaming cheese, what's in these? I'm a poet, oh, I didn't know it. Cheese and chilli seasoning. Buttermilk powder. Flavourings. Cheese powder. Spices, chilli and white pepper. Garlic powder. Acid! Yeast extract. extract acidity regulator. Colour, yada yada yada. Is it right? Crisps in the tub. Yeah, can you smell them? It's not cheese. They smell quite cheesy, actually. As I'm sure they should do. Give their cheese flavour. Anyway, fucking die. I'm fucking dreading them. Anyway, sorry for swearing. It's my fucking channel, I'll do what I want. You see a little bit of um coat little um flex. Not Robert Fleck. All you Norwich fans out there. Um Sean Orf. You might be a Norwich fan, might be an Ipswich fan. If I'm upset you, I do apologise. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> enough waffling. Nice and cheesy.
Hmm. Interesting. All right. Um. Contro controversy. There's a controversy here. Let's got review things. I don't know if they're a builder, actually. I don't know if they're a grower. Um, my mouth, there is a nice, hot, um, dry, chilli spice, crispy chilli spice, um, warmth going on in my, in my back of my, on the real top of my tongue. I'm going to say, there's not, in heat-wise, there ain't a lot between them, in all honesty. Might do one together, a couple together. They are nice and cheesy, so if you like a hot, cheesy snack of ridge, then you're going to like them. Not a lot, but you might. Not a lot. So two together. Bit like Gary Lineker, isn't it? Anyway. Get me in trouble. Fuck him. They are really nice, actually. They are quite nice. They are, there is, look, if you're adverse to heat, they ain't for you. But on the heat factor, there is a spice to them. There is a um, a very dry heat across my tongue. I don't think these are any hotter than these. But they're both really nice. If you like, obviously, with a beer, if you've got a beer, Set outside, well, you wouldn't know, it's fucking freezing. But if you were set outside or indoors, and you, it was like, again, absolute fabulous snacks, snack crisps. Um, pardon me, uh, I don't know what the other two like the, the barbecue beef and the all the other ones I said, uh, barbecue and sour cream, but both of them. Bit just, I would like to, if, if you're going to say that that's a three chilli heat and that's a two chilli heat, I'd like it, I'd like it pronouncedly different, um, but they're not. They are of similar, similar heats. For them, the chilli and lime are Mexicano. Arriba! They're going to get a thumbs up from Scott Review Things. And uh, flaming cheese flavour. I'm going to give them a thumbs up. Although they're not anywhere like massively hotter than these, they are really nice. They're really nice cheesy flavour to them. They're going to go down really well. They're going to come out really well uh, in agony. Tomorrow morning, wondering where my life's gone wrong. Amen to my bum. Um, yeah, um, if you've had these... Let me know what you think of them. If you haven't, there's two other flavours. See what you think. If you want to see me review any other hot stuff, then just don't comment, because you're just being nasty to me, and that's just not very nice, is it? So, um, yeah, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't give it a thumbs down, there's a subscribe button there, over there somewhere. I'm looking at the proper Naga Chili Chicken Itchings, thinking I'm going to die. See you soon.